Guy Ritchie, John Woo, Tony Scott, what do all three of them have in common? They've done films for BMW. In 2001 and 2002, and then once more in 2016, we need to talk about that one, BMW went out to genuinely interesting filmmakers. Ang Lee did one, John Carnahan, John Frankenheimer. Where BMW looked to find all of these directors, I have no earthly idea. Why BMW funded these, I fully understand. So many car ads now are largely CG. They're uninteresting. They feature a couple interior angles and a car driving off into the sunset. The Hire did not. The Hire had interesting storylines. It tackled things like domestic abuse in the narrative of a car ad. You had Clive Owen, the unnamed driver, as the star of each one, each time in a different vehicle. You got to see the full range of BMW's lineup in interesting situations from visionary filmmakers. Again, John Woo. Can you fill a BMW with doves? This is how you find out. That 2001 to 2002 run even culminated in Clive Owen standing in as the ringer for James Brown in a drag race against the devil, played by Gary Oldman. These discs, this was the DVD era, were hard to come by. You had to get them from specific BMW dealerships, or eventually some of them found their way online. I only got to see them as a child because my dad went out and purchased an X5 when that was brand new. Ask him how that went. Most of them can now be found on, of all places, the YouTube channel for BMW of India, but there are always discs floating around. Keep circulating the tapes. The Hire series is such an interesting counterpoint to so much generic automotive advertising now. They are ads, yes, but they reached out to genuinely interesting filmmakers who had neat things to say through the medium of film. The camera is not just showing a car, it's doing something interesting within the scene, within the narrative. Go out and watch these movies, and as the early 2000s are coming back, as we're seeing this revival in fashion and pop culture, bring back car advertising like The Hire. For more on this and every other car ad I think is neat, keep your eyes peeled at jalopnik.com.